Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial. If you are new here, my name is Leah and today I'm going to be teaching you guys Flower by Jisoo. So we're going to be giving this dance a difficulty score of five out of 10, another beginner friendly dance to add to our playlist. So what we're going to be doing is an explanation tutorial today. As usual, if you would like to practice with the music, then I will leave my slow music tutorial linked in the top right hand corner of the screen. If you would like to practice with a tutorial where the explanation and the music is in one video, for you that is on my patreon page if you are interested in supporting me over on patreon I'll leave the links in my description and a shout out to my new supporters who have joined me in March and the beginning of April as well so remember guys if I'm speaking too fast or too slow for you at any point in this tutorial feel free to change the speed of the video in the YouTube settings okay so let's get started all right, this is lesson one, and this is the chorus. This will be the only lesson today, and we are gonna start on the last eight counts of the pre-chorus that build up into the chorus. So this is a preview of the first eight counts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so that's what we're gonna be learning first. What you're going to do is get your right hand on your chest, left hand on your stomach. You're going to kind of crawl your fingers across to hug yourself like this and your fingers are crawling across like this. As you do that, you're going to sit down on your right hip and bend your knees. One, two, now on three, we're going to go three. We're going to step out with our left foot, keep our hands still now and look over down to the left. So again from the beginning. One, two, three, now on four and we're going to go four and here. So from here, bring your left foot in now as we do that, we're going to get our arms in an X and they're going to spin around like this. So again from here, just overlap your arms from this position. We're going to spin around, so your right hand should be coming towards your face. Spin around with your wrists connected underneath your chin. So from here, like that, okay? So from the beginning, from here. One, two, three, four and five. Now on five, we're going to sit down like this with our hands underneath our chin. So again, four and five. Now as soon as we sit, we're going to come back up. So straighten out your knees again. As you straighten out your knees, you're going to curl your fingers from pinky to thumb into a fist. So again, four and five, six. Now on seven, eight, we're going to go seven, eight. So from here, your hands should be in fists. Push them forward with your right on top of your left. Seven, straight forward, eight. You're gonna open out your fingers like this, like a flower blooming. So from here, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so those are the first eight counts. That is technically the end of the pre-chorus. What we're gonna do is recap from here all the way from the beginning before we continue. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So from here, the next few moves will go like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so from this move here, your right hand should be on the top, left hand on the bottom. We're gonna spin them this direction. So your right hand's gonna turn downwards and your left hand just follows. You're gonna spin, 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 close. You're gonna close your hands into fists. So again, with counts, one, two, three, four, you close on four. Now open your hands back out and spin back to the original direction. So you're gonna get your right hand spin back to the original direction again. On five, six, seven, eight. Again, you're gonna close your fists. So just the hands, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, as we do that, from the end of here to begin the chorus, we're gonna swing our hips to the right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Very straightforward from here. Have a slight bend in your knees. You're gonna step right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, as you do those hand movements. So from the beginning of this chorus part with the hand movements, with the flower moving, let's do that now. So this will go. One, two, three, close, five, six, seven, close, okay? Now what we're going to do is gonna put our left hand on our hip, right hand is still in the fist. We're gonna step out with our right foot, we're going to go one and two, 
okay? From the end of here, put your left hand to your hip. We're gonna get our right elbow, elbow to the side, to the side, two times. We're gonna step out with our right foot to the side, to the side. So your right hip is going to the right and right. With our elbow, right and right. So from this flower move again, let's go from this part. Bit slower this time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two. Okay, just before we continue so that you guys don't forget, let's go from the very beginning, so from the pre-chorus part, from here, da, 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 open. We're gonna go all the way from that part and recap with the counts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two. Okay, so after one and two, we're going to go three and four. We're gonna get our left foot crossing over. We're gonna tap and tap two times. And as we do that, we're gonna get our right hand flat open and we're gonna jab, jab on the side of our jaw here, here, okay? From this part here, this will go one and two, three and four. Okay, step with your left and left. Next move, we're going to go five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so that was just to show you. From this point here, we're gonna get our hands in this gesture here. Connect your index finger and your thumb. We're going to step with our right foot. We're gonna swing these gestures to the right side and then to the left side. So step over with your right foot, swing your hips to the right, then to the left, along with your hands, right, left. So let's go from this move here, like that, on one, two. One, two, three, Four, now with the fingers, five, six, so to the right, left. Next, we're gonna get our left hand on our hip. We're gonna step with our right foot backwards. Now, as we do that, so put your left hand to your hip, right hand's gonna go flat open, step back with your right foot. You're gonna spin this around over to the side of your mouth. We're gonna have a tilt to the right side, left foot in front of your right hand to the side of your mouth. So from here, on five, five, Six, step back with your right foot. Seven, eight. You wanna nod down and up, okay? So again, from this move, one and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so that is the first half. What we're gonna do is go all the way from the beginning, from the pre-chorus part here, like that and do that all with the counts before we continue to the second half. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so after here, this is what the next few moves will look like. One and two, three and four. Okay, so from here, so hands alone, you're going to get your right hand, you're gonna tap it down on your thigh and push out. Then the other side, you're gonna get your left hand, tap it down on your thigh and out. So tap and out, tap and out. From here, this is the last place we finished. We're gonna bring up our left knee to tap our thigh. So tap and put your foot back down, out. On out, you're gonna push the right hand out and again, lift your left leg and we're gonna swoop back to the front. From here, tap and out, swoop back to the front, go onto your right leg and swoop your left leg around. So with count, this will go one and two. Next, we're gonna do the other side. So we're gonna jump onto this left leg in the back. We're gonna go three and four. 
So again from here, jump onto your left leg, get your left hand off your hip, keep your right hand where it is. So tap, step, and then push out again like this and raise your right foot off the floor and swoop it back around to the back. From here, this will go with counts. One and two, three and four. Okay, swoop your right leg around. Next from here, we're gonna step backwards with our right foot. We're going to go five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so what we're gonna do here is step down with our right foot in the back. We're gonna get our hands that are flat open, cross them in front of you like this, like an X, and they're curving towards each other. Cross, sit down on your right hip, cross behind your head and li lift up your left hip behind your head, straighten out in the top like this. So your hands are simply going cross behind your head and straighten out. Remember, as we do that, we're stepping with our right, up with our left hip and straighten out our hips and straighten out your arms to the top. So with counts from the second half here, this will go one and two, three and four, five, six, seven to the top, eight. On eight, you're gonna push these hands down slightly and also nod your head down and up, eight. Okay, just before we continue, once again, let's recap the second half from here, like this. Let's do that with the count, then we'll finish off this part. One and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, from here on eight. What we're gonna do is we're gonna push our hands down into fists like this in front of our chest from here. After eight, this will go one. As you bring these fists down, you're gonna kind of put the, the weight on your left leg. So just kind of lean forward on that left leg. So from here, this will go one, step with your left leg. Next, we're gonna go two, three, four. So from here on one, we're gonna step right, left, right, and kind of swing our hips as well. Now when we swing our hips, we're gonna also swing our hands to the same side. So when you go to the right, push your hands to the right at the wrist, then left, then right. So again from here, this will go one, two, three, four. Next, to finish this part, this will go five, six, seven, eight. So what we're doing from the end of here, we're going to get our hands up in an X like this. So cross your arms into fists, make an X to the top left, push your hips to the left like this. So from here, this will go five. Also, we're kind of looking down on the bottom left as well. Five, six. On six, you're gonna switch your hips to the right side and put your hands in fists on either side of your shoulders. And we're also gonna look down on the bottom right. So again, from the end of four, Five, six, now in seven, eight, get your right foot, step behind you, and we're going to go seven, eight. Again from here, step behind with your right leg, like this, and kind of bend your left leg forward slightly. As we do that, we're gonna get our hands right on top of the left, touch off each other, and glide outwards. And just let this hand fall slowly. So we're gonna go from this part here, when we do this move. So from the end of eight, this will go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then that is the end of the chorus part. So what we're going to be doing is going from the second half one more time. So from the end of here, touch and out, touch and out. And then this move here, okay? We're gonna do all of that now with the counts. Then we're gonna go all the way from the very beginning, from here, dun, da, 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 push open, and do that with the counts throughout the whole chorus as well. One and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching this tutorial and well done if you made it through the whole thing. If you guys would like to cool down and stretch with me, I will leave my cool down stretch video that you guys can do after you learn dances and on your rest days as well. If you would like to learn a different Blackpink solo, I have taught La Lisa, which I will leave in the top right hand corner, along with my probably my most recent Blackpink tutorials as well, in case you're interested. Don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more tutorials. I will see you guys in my next video.